There's more to your home internet performance than you might think. Let's dive in. It comes down to three main things, internet speed, home setup and size, and device usage and capability. First, let's explain what internet speed is and how it's measured. Internet speed is all about how fast data travels, measured in megabits per second, or Mbps for short. Think of it as your internet speedometer. When we talk about gigabit, or gig speeds, we're talking about a remarkable 1000 plus Mbps, delivering lightning fast fiber connectivity to your home. For optimal speed and performance, a wired connection to your device is best. But we all know the majority of our devices are wireless. This is where Wi-Fi steps in. Your router takes this internet connection and turns it into a wireless signal. So, what affects the strength or quality of a wireless signal in your home? The setup and size of your home matters. Square footage, number of floors, thickness of walls, all affect Wi-Fi signal strength. Distance from the router is important too. The farther you are from your router, the weaker and slower the connection. If you have a large space, adding a Wi-Fi extender can optimize performance throughout the home. Now, let's talk about your devices. Every connected device in your home is hungry and wants to take a bite of the bandwidth pie. The more devices sharing the signal, the more it gets divided up. And the age of your devices is also a factor. Older devices with older generations of Wi-Fi technology could be putting the brakes on your connection. So, to set yourself up for Wi-Fi success, make sure you have the right connection speed for your home, review your setup, and assess the number of devices you're using and their compatibility. Keeping these factors in mind will help maximize your home Wi-Fi experience.